so basically Mr. Boom is a um, game that needs strategy, speed, flexibility. Very often, if you make a mistake, you will be bombed out, but it doesn't mean you can not get out all the time. Um, the thing is, you can see, use the button B to drop a bomb and A to trigger. Uh, it depends what kind of keyboards you have. I have a German keyboard, so for me, moving will be not uh, WASP, W-A-S-P, but W-A-S-D. And to drop a bomb will be control, to jump will be shift. But depending on the keyboard, it will be something else. So if you start the game, just know that you have to test first every key to see what it does. Personally, on my keyboard, if I press uh, shift, I can also add a, a player, and if I press space, I can add a bot. Uh, I can add as much bot as I want, up to 7 bots. I can even let bots play with each other. Uh, I can put a second one, but basically if I die, the bot will be playing together until they die, and it can take a lot of time. So I just choose one. Uh, to start, it's very easy, you just press enter. Okay, so that's an interesting map. I think we are in some kind of casino. So I lay my bombs. A bomb can only destroy one block. Doesn't matter how powerful, but one block in each direction. Uh, I just took a fire, which means that, as you will see, okay, my bomb explodes much further but where there is no blocks. Uh, okay. So I'm not gonna liberate my the small monsters there. Just gonna let them... Oh, damn! I just liberated one without knowing. Oh, god damn it! I got eaten by a monster. Okay, so as you can see, there are five, basically, uh, points. If one player has five points, the player wins. Ah, uh, the ice. So I'm bottom left. The best is to begin in near the middle, so you have more things to destroy. Corners are not very good, actually. But you have to do with what you have. Okay, a heart. You cannot see how much parts you have. You just have to know it. So I have one life more. That's good. You have to wait that the first bomb exploded before taking the over. Other one. Oh! So I can lay one bomb more because I took the thing, but I exploded so I only have uh, zero life basically. Oh yeah, the enemy bot has been killed, so it's because we're only two, it just stops. I'm gonna keep playing until I beat the sheep out of them. <laughs> okay, that's a typical mistake. It liberated a monster and the monster killed her. Do not liberate monsters if you don't have space to lay bombs, because you will either kill you or get blocked and be killed by the monster. So. First rule, don't kill yourself with your own bombs. Second rule is don't get blocked. And third rule is get as much stuff as possible. The best way to not get blocked is not de-block any monsters. Every monster is blocked at the beginning of the game, so don't help them escape. Okay, now I can lay one bomb more. I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna die. <sighs> okay, my bombs are not exploding anymore. Oh, I found an egg. Because as you all know, kangaroos do come from eggs. What? 
with the kangaroo I can press basically a shift and move in one direction. So you move in the direction and you press shift. Okay, I can kick bombs now. My bombs are super powerful. Okay, this uh, snail is gonna explode. Snails are the easiest to kill. Just free explosion and it's dead. I don't know why I cannot kick bombs anymore. I think bomb bombs kicking is uh, probably... Oh damn, I killed myself. I did not respect rule number one. Okay, we have to be fast on this one. Bamboo shoot. Bamboo shoot. So the, the skull here, if you take it, uh, your navigation is inverted, so if you go right it goes left, if you go up it goes down and so on. Okay, now we are on the grass. So I can literally push bombs all the time, I don't have to have anything. Oh shoot. Okay, I blocked it. Boom. One last. And it kills it. What did I win? More bounce. Huge. Huge deal. And of course it's a very dynamic game, so your bomb change, your capacity of laying bombs increases. The area of effect of bomb increases. The music is very dynamic and pushes you to go fast. And you also want to go fast. It's kind of nice. So here on this map we are on the sky, and sky map means basically if you want good stuff, you have to, you may have to break all the bricks down to middle up or middle bottom. Okay, I'm going to die. No, what did I do? Okay, it doesn't explode. That's bad. So we are blocked. That's it. I freaking blocked. Just lay a bomb, you! Lay a freaking bomb. Oh, if she lays a bomb, she dies. But my bomb doesn't explode, so that's a bug. Basically. I can do nothing. Is nothing in action? No. So this game is very dynamic, there's a lot of options, but if it bugs like this... That's it for today, I hope you enjoyed it. If you want a video with a pure gameplay, from beginning to end, uh, I did one for you, you can click uh, on the icon, else if you want uh, more information about the game and installation you can just look at the description of the video below